Hi guys, welcome to CA Inter MCQs. We are doing a chapter of unit and batch costing. Unit costing is followed whereby companies manufacture one single type of a product on a large scale. Batch costing is followed whereby a group of homogeneous units are made. And then to find out each and every uh, cost of each and every unit, we divide the cost of that batch with the number of units. These MCQs are from the module in the beginning. Once these are covered, then we are going to be doing our own MCQs. So therefore, your base of MCQs is very strong. And the new course MCQs are very important. They'll help you to score very high. It'll also accomplish your mission of getting the rank. So ensure that you know the reasoning of every MCQ. Join our Telegram channel and uh, in case you're interested in purchasing the course, the link is there in the description. Let's see what MCQ we all have today to discuss. So the production planning department prepares a list of the materials and stores required for completion of a specific job order. This list is known as bin card. Okay, B. Bill of material. C. Material requisition slip. And D. None of the above. Let me tell you where each thing is there. Automatically, we'll know the answer. Bin cards. Bin cards are used in the stores department to keep a track how many units came in the storehouse and how many units went out from the storehouse. Okay, it's basically a controlling kind of a card. It's maintained by the workers to keep inventory control. So this is not the answer. The question is what beta? Whenever you get any job, you try to prepare a list of what all materials are required for that job. That bill or that list is called as what? Okay, so A cannot be the answer. A is just like, you know, stores ledger control account, but only on a quantitative basis. So A is not your answer. Okay, then what about B? B is bill of material. That should be the answer. Bill of material is basically, suppose, uh, you told the carpenter that I want this kind of a wardrobe. Okay, for this wardrobe, what all materials will be required? All those things, all those things will be nothing but whatever is the list of the materials is called as bill of material. Okay. Uh, C, material requisition form is basically what? You have a factory, you have a stores department. Factory requires the material, but the material is there in the stores department. Whichever material the factory will require, they will give a request to the stores department that please send us these materials. That voucher, that slip is called as material requisition slip. So that is not whatever the question is asking. And D, none of the above. So answer over here in this case should be B. So as per me, B should be the correct answer. Yeah, that's the correct one.